Hey guys, Matt coming at you. Quick video. Uh, I had a couple requests to do my West Virginia University WVU showcase. I'd never done it before because I don't have a whole lot, so I just have a little bit. As you know, a lot of not a lot of great pros have one run through a WVU, but uh, we're getting there. And right now we're building some people up. And I don't have a lot of people. I'm still looking for like a Geno autograph, Stedman, uh, like a Sam Huff. Uh, some legendary players as well. So if you have any WVU players, you should just let me know. <laughs> anyway, um, just real quick, uh, I'm just going to run through some of the cards and all that jazz. So, anywho, Ricky Jersey, Joe Alexander. Lottery pick, ended up doing nothing in the NBA, but he was a beast at West Virginia. Uh, dual jersey from SPX of Joe as well. Uh... Autograph from what Tops Treasury rookie. I really love these cards and the design on them. Obviously, Joe didn't turn out quite what we thought. Like uh, triple jersey autograph, home version SPX. Um, dual on card. This is actually super nice with Ryan Anderson. Really cool. That's actually okay because Anderson's still playing well. Next one's Kevin Jones. He was a beast, got robbed the Big East Player of the Year, gave it to Crowder, but he's one of our better players in history. He's uh, really undersized, so he played for the Cavs a little bit last year. He's mainly a rebounder, but he's having a pretty good year for the Canton Charge in the D-League. And uh, he may be called up soon, I don't know. Couldn't hurt, right? Uh, of course, we got Jersey, Deshaun Butler to 499. If you don't know who Deshaun Butler is, he didn't. He never got to play officially a game in the NBA because uh, he tore his ACL in the uh, Final Four game against Duke. Uh, West Virginia ended up losing that, and uh, he was never the same. He had a lot of complications in recovery, but he was a beast. He hit probably 10 game winners his senior year. He had some 40-point games. He was just he was everything to the West Virginia program. So. Um, uh, Deshaun Butler is very popular around this area. There's an autograph from Hoops. Uh, and he's one of the most respected players in the history. It's 199 Rookie Auto Prestige. And uh, Deshaun's one of my favorite players of all time. On card autograph 299 Prestige. And I still wish he'd get a shot because he could ball. Uh, draft Patch Auto. This next guy is killing the D League right now. Averaging like 25 and 10, been jamming 40 point games. He's a stud right now, and it's Devin E. Banks. First card to 75, autograph from Preferred. I have no idea why he's not on a roster at the moment. If somebody could explain that to me, that'd be awesome. One card out of 99, Preferred. Draft Patch, Prestige, 499. Just been having a great year. He was good at West Virginia. Could never shoot, but apparently he's developing. Well, he is, I've noticed. 299 Timeless Treasures. Um, the alternate short print version from Contenders. Ricky Auto 2 299 from Gold Standard. Triple Jersey Auto Absolute. 299. This is pretty nice, number to 50, Jersey Auto, Timeless Treasures. And then I pulled this out of a Target retail pack, number out of 50, three color patch. Pretty sweet from Threads. And then my last three autographs, uh, this guy is in the Super Bowl right now. Uh, number to 99, autograph from Prism, rookie of Bruce Irvin. He is a stud. He is so fast and so dynamic. He was a stud at West Virginia, and he's playing well for the Hawks. And this kid, everybody loves Tavon. Autograph Tavon Austin, rookie. Really wants Stedman and Gino. And then lastly, Mr. Basketball, Mr. Clutch, yada, yada, yada. Best, one of the best players ever, and the best probably West Virginia Mountaineer of all time, Jerry West. So how cool is that? <laughs> and then last couple things. Got this autographed football from the entire team this year. The whole Mountaineer squad, which ended up sucking. 
But, um, yeah, it, it turned out pretty cool. I have everybody that was on the team, so pretty sweet. I uh, got this Final Four basketball autographed in person by Bob Huggins. Bob Huggins, one of the best coaches to ever coach. And then lastly, I got this uh, huge picture, autographed picture. Got this from my cousin of uh, Gino Eugene Smith. People need to lay off Gino right now. He didn't have the best season, but have you seen his weapons? That is all I gotta say on that one. He'll get better. They need to draft a receiver. If my core was, you know, Jeremy Curley, David Nelson, Curley's all right. Uh, Santonio Holmes, who never plays. Jeff Cumberland, Bilal Powell. Yeah, I'd struggle too, probably. But that is the WVU PCism now. Uh, thanks for watching, and let's go Mountaineers later.